Hey guys, this is Zach Wilder here. Wanted to bring you this video to give you a guide on how to defeat Storm Terror. I, I had some challenges uh, defeating this boss earlier on because I didn't know which lineup or which setup that I should use, which characters fitted the uh, game style and the waves of attack that this boss presents. But um, yeah. So I wanted to skip through this since it's quite easy to figure out. Just basically dodge the uh, incoming electric waves or bullets. Shoot the portals so that you can get an XP exploration. It's, it's, it's pretty much straightforward from here. The most challenging part is coming up next, uh, which is the, uh, uh, the main fight against this boss. I thoroughly enjoyed this. It was challenging at first because... There's a few things that I did not know I had to figure out along the way and mainly you'll see now it's the uh, platform. Okay, so my lineup were Venti, uh, Mona, uh, Zhang Zang Ling, Shan Ling, uh, and Razor. Pretty much I don't think I've used the Razor once in this fight. <laughs> but yeah, you do need a fourth. If that fourth can be anyone, really. All right. So the most important thing, guys, here is you gotta pay attention to the pattern of attack that this boss imposes. The best optimum first hero is a ranged hero. Uh, that's why I opted with Venti. A uh, Venti or Amber would do, but uh, Venti did more damage for some reason. Even though they're both of the same element, they're both wind, the boss and venti. So, so this is one of the attacks uh, that he channels. It's like a whirlwind. It always starts from the left. If you pay attention, it always starts from the left. I've never seen it start from the right. <clears throat> so as soon as you see him do that motion, you you gotta jump to the right, dash, dash, and then uh, attack the claw as much as you can. Bring that shield down so that he drops. The minute he drops, he exposes himself on top. Uh, get the most damaging hero that you have, your DPS, and um, save the special for that moment. Uh, as you can see, I did more than half damage just by one hero. I didn't even switch my heroes. Alright, this is the second wave of attack. This is one of his main attacks. Uh, so this does damage over time to the area you're in. So as you can see, there's a there's a swift on the left that you can glide through. So you can change platforms. You gotta hop two different platforms. So that's the first platform, and then this is the second platform, which has no damage to it. So his attack remains on the other two platforms. So that's something I did not know fighting him the first time, but now that I knew this, like it made it made everything so much easier because that it, that was the main attack that was causing problems for me. Yeah, when he attacks like that and he brings his head down, um, you can still damage him. So it doesn't have to be only the claws. So all right, so right now I w uh, did the swift on him. And some down, and then I, I dodged to the right, did more damage to the right one. And I dropped him down again. And this is here, you can climb up, climb up his neck. And then as soon as you, yeah, as soon as you're up there, um, if you have a hero that can deploy or summon any kind of uh, moves, like pets, uh, then um, I would highly suggest it because it does damage over time and it does sustained damage. Like the damage uh, is consistent. So that's why I have Mona and uh, Jang Ling. So yeah, I'm gonna do more damage on him to the right side. Look how much I'm bringing his shield down. Like it's insane. This hero is one of my favorites. And once again for the final sweep, and this is how you end it. Pretty much it's very simple. And if you have special attacks, save them for the top like that, and uh, voila. He is defeated. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Alright guys, so if you, if you don't want to have any spoilers, then I suggest you skip this. Uh, but uh, yeah, so that is it for the video guys if you have any questions or any uh, suggestions on what heroes anyone else should use Please leave them in the comments below and let me know what you think All right, it was a pleasure guys. Uh, thank you so much for watching uh, until next time. Have a good one